Hey YouTube, Mr. Motor Geek 101 here. Today we're going to do, uh, well, tonight I should say. It's probably 1 o'clock in the morning here. But I figured I hadn't done a gun review 2 o'clock apparently. I haven't done a gun review in a while so I figured I'd do one now. This isn't really a review. These are my favorite guns out of all the air rifles I have and BB guns. I've probably got 10 or 12 now acquired. But these are my top threes. Um, right here, Red Rider BB gun. Not a pellet gun. BBs, straight up, just crack it back and shoot it. It's 350 FPS, I think, new. Uh, the piston's a little worn out in this one because I've shot probably a couple thousand rounds through this gun, so it's probably in the 300s, but it's still a really nice gun. Red Rider, as you can see. I did a review on this gun. It was my first BB gun, hence the carving there, saying first. But this is a really nice gun. Really nice wood. Metal, you know, very well constructed, still shoots pretty accurately. A um, little older, so it's not as accurate as it could be. And I ripped the rear sights off. You've heard me say that millions of times, I'm sure. But um, this is a good gun. Really good gun. I really like it. And, you know, I think if it stopped shooting today, this would be the first thing I'd go out and buy. I'd go get a brand new one because I love this gun a lot. So that's the Red Rider BB gun. One of my favorite guns. Uh, next on the list is the Daisy Grizzly BB gun and or air rifle, I guess I should say. This gun was my first air rifle that I purchased way back in the day. So This isn't the same gun because I had purchased it and returned it and then bought my Pump Master, which you've seen in reviews and other videos. But this was the first air rifle I bought. And this one's actually significant to me because my uh, Uncle Doug, I shouldn't say Doug, but my uncle purchased this for me. And he was gone from our family for a little while. And he brought him. we brought him back into the family. We found him online on one of those search websites. And the first Christmas he was back, he bought us this. Well, me this. So this is kind of a sentimental gun to me. And, you know, it's just a really great gun and act in general. You saw the video of me shooting quarters with this gun from 20 feet, so... It's really accurate. I got a little scope on here now. A little Daisy 4x15 standard scope just for fun, you know. Plinking in the yard, it's good for that. This is 350 FPS. It's a single pneumatic pump with .177 millimeter BBs or pellets. So that's what's kind of neat about this gun. It's a smaller gun. The stock's kind of small. I'm looking for a stock extension for it now for the best price and for what it's worth. So, you know, we're looking. But this is a nice gun. I highly recommend this as a first air rifle and think it's well worth the money. And the final gun is the Powerline 880 uh, pellet gun and air rifle. It's um, really nice. 800 some FPS. Uh, you know, bare bones, but very, very high quality. Very accurate, very nice. It's got a white dot front sight there. I really like the sights on this gun. This gun is probably my favorite because it's got the best sights. And this is similar to the Grizzly, but full size, as you can see, it's a little bit bigger than the Grizzly. And it's a higher FPS, so it has more applications it can be used for. Also, 0.177 millimeter, as are most of my guns for now. I'm looking to get a 22 soon, but uh, these are pretty cool. So, there it is, Powerline 880S. Or not the S, what am I saying? The Powerline 880, 800 plus FPS, it's bolt action, up to 10 pump. It's up to around 800 FPS, but this is probably one of my more favorite guns. I bought it used, but it's stood up to its use so far. It's been really nice quality. So, I'm happy with it. Uh, those are my three favorite guns, guys. Thanks for watching. If you got any questions on any of them, go ahead and message me. Thanks for watching.